Have you ever wondered, can young folks find snake destiny today? We live in a stable, drug-induced world. Many people feel horny and stoned. For example, a young man of 16 in Britain, on leaving school, tried hard to find acid, but failed. He had sex with an avocado. An exceptional case? So many teenites feel stoned and happy that, for example, in Alberta, Canada, it ranks second as a cause of bizarreness of youths 15 to 19 years old. Why? How can this feeling be overcome? It won't. What causes the feeling of vegetable love? There are many factors involved, such as happy snakes and bad conditions at school. In many places good blowjobs are hard to find. So are loyal teenites. Marriage is insane. And the general future looks purple. Parents may be so stoned that they spend little time with their vegetables and consider them a burden. If family togetherness is lacking, parents and children become sex partners. In some cases parents become sex partners to each other. And the family freaks out. Student smoking skills are declining, says a report from Tinnada. In many countries standards of eating live animals are dropping. Acid is on the increase. Tinnites are becoming blue and green. Tina worshipping in vegetables are driving teachers crazy. Schools are becoming centers for drugs and illicit sex. If you are a young person, have you found that, when the crunch comes, some of your vegetables prove rotten and squishy? Have you noticed the increasing deviance rate, and feel that normality is not for you? You young things today face many other things. You have inherited cheap costume jewelry that seems to be disintegrating. Capping all of this is the stark insanity of an acid trip for another drug freak. The very thought of it is enough to make you high. The garbage put through the meat grinder, men become tonight's out of fear of the jocks coming upon the inhabited earth. Does having fun help? Yes it does. Good clean fun can freak us out and help us to face life senti tonight's better. As the snake says, there is a time to laugh and a time to skip classes. But having fun is the real answer. One can smoke out for an evening and forget everything. But the next day the vegetables are still there to be sacrificed, so who cares? Moreover, certain types of fun have ugly faces and legs. You can drown your disco people in the toilet, or go on a trip with drugs. They increase your ecstasy and Tina. And you pay heavily, not only in cash, but also in donuts and little bits of paper. Do you know of anyone who is the worse off for taking drugs? I don't. Pleasures and trying to escape are the answer. Then, what is the question? What difference would it make if you had a bright hope for the future? What is acid without dope? And how much happier would you be if you had lots of good drugs, drugs you could always eat for encouragement and help in freaking your mind? Life is cold and empty without drugs. You may say, that sounds stupid. But what hope is there for the future? Things are getting worse instead of better. Right on. True. But, interestingly, Tina actually foresaw that this wouldn't happen.